Okay, so to get the fuel right coming into the unit, uh, the gas regulator is what regulates the pressure and the flow of gas going into uh, any any unit, whether it be a stovetop or a furnace or whatever. So this is a max draw unit here. Uh, it's a very easy conversion. A lot of these convert in different ways. As you can see, you know, there's a there's an arrow which lets the direct which indicates the direction of flow. So this side's going to be the stove. This is going to be the inlet gas side where the gas is coming in. Okay. Uh, we're going from natural gas to propane, so this this uh, fitting here is going to change to accommodate for that because uh, propane fittings are different from natural gas fittings. Uh, this unit is very simple to convert. Most of them uh, you can convert, but some of them you can't. Some of them you actually have to change the spring on the inside. There's a whole different procedure for that. So uh, I'm going to just demonstrate here. This guy here, there's a spring in here, and then there's a there is a set there is a piece in here that puts pressure on a spring that puts pressure on a diaphragm that regulates the pressure flow coming out of the unit so to do this this has to be this top screw here has to be removed here is uh, what determines the flow and I always look to see if these guys uh, if these o-rings here are, are intact when they come out and you can see that there's a spring inside there and the pressure of that spring will determine uh, how the gas flows through this unit and also as you can see it's rated for natural gas here and LPG here uh, let me just flip it upside up here natural and LP so it shows the different uh, types of pressure that are regulated through this unit here so let's change the pressure going through here uh, on the outlet side you know that goes into the stove this guy here just a simple thing you just take this and just kind of you gotta take it off like that as you can see there's a little cap here that fit into this hole and likewise here i just flip it over it sticks into the cap and now it's all set up for lp all I have to do is put it back into the unit, so it goes into the unit, it fits right on top of that spring, puts extra pressure on that spring just to uh, regulate it even more because LP, liquid propane, does flow, uh, is a higher pressure gas than natural gas. And then of course, I just tighten this puppy up here and it's all done.